Hi everyone, welcome back to Healing Days Oracle or welcome if you're new. Today you have your yes or no pick a card of the week. I add this video every week to help you out with a question that you know you need a simple yes or no answer. And today we have four different options. If you're new here, consider subscribing, like and share this video, it helps the channel very much. All my links are below. If you want to have a private reading with me or anything from my Etsy shop, you also can become a member of this channel now and we have a special live readings just for members. So hopefully you can join that and you enjoy those times here getting to know each other readings for you guys. And today we have a group one with power, group two with simplicity, group three with change and group four with focus. Whichever one calls your attention first is most likely the right one, but of course you can watch the full video and see which one resonates the most. As always, my details, the cards that I use, a way for you to support this channel will always be on the description below. Again guys, group 1, 2, 3 and 4, timestamp below. Thanks for watching! Group 1, if you chose power, we leave here and we start with the pendulum. So group 1, yes or no. As always, guys, put some intentions, whether this is a positive or negative question. And my links are below if you want to have a private reading with me or anything from my Etsy shop. Group one, yes or no. And I'll try to get some time frame here for some of you who needs time frame as well. Group one, yes or no. Okay, it's ask a friend. So ask a friend here, guys. Asking a friend will be helpful. Okay, so what else can we understand about it? Okay, so asking a friend, asking someone, what else do you need to know? Building is strength. We do have in the next few weeks. This is a yes for you, group one, okay? Building is strength here. Something could be building strength, okay? We are on springtime right now. So it is in the next few weeks for you, no doubt, okay? This is just double confirmation. It is my time frame anyway, you know, resolutions are near. Healing needed. I'll get one more card here anyway. Synchronicities and signs. Okay, guys, so it really shows that, uh, you know, this is building strength, right? So it could be that uh, it's someone building strength could be you building strength could be this relationship building strength you know there are many things here unfolding resolving in the next few weeks already it is springtime right now so i feel like this is just flourishing just to tell you no this is going to turn around and resolve for you it is a yes okay for positive or negative questions anyway but there are resolutions you know resolutions are near even if it is a negative question there's something that can be resolved because it's building strength in the next few weeks already. So I feel like for manifestations, resolutions, it's very soon, guys, okay? The next few weeks, I feel like things are building momentum, building strength here. And there's still healing needed in some of situations. You know, take uh, what's resonating here for you. But some of um, you or some of your questions is still going through, you know, some healing process here. You know, a healing road here. Could be the person that you're thinking about, that you're asking about, or that's involved in your question. Could be them, could be you. There's some healing here, you know, and it could be something that um, is going to be resolved slowly. That's why you need a couple of weeks here. And it could be something that's going on for a while. But it's very soon because in the next few weeks and the resolutions are soon. But there's some synchronicities and signs happening here as well for you guys, okay? And I feel like you will feel that. You know, things are synchronizing, things are aligning. You meet that person by coincidence. You talk about that specific situation with someone, with a friend, by coincidence. But there's no coincidences. Are just synchronicities, signs, the universe aligning things for you. You chose uh, or you fell here and ask a friend for the pendulum. So I do feel like you can reach out to someone here. It could be a friend. It could be a colleague. But there's someone that will be there for you. Even if you think there's no one I could ask here right now, there is someone. You know, when the universe tells you, ask a friend, it's because someone is there to help you out or will pop up out of nowhere to help you out. You know, synchronicities, signs again being sent and you chose power. So I do feel like you need to tap into that power within to have the courage to reach out to someone, to talk with someone, to be honest with yourself, whoever's involved in your question. I feel like you just need to tap into that courage because this is already manifesting for you in the next few weeks or resolving, even if it's a negative question, guys. Resolutions are so near even though there's still some healing happening right now in the meantime. So tap into that power within for healing, for courage, for communication, for honesty with yourself, you know, and 
building strength. I do feel like this power is because you're building strength within. To be honest with anybody involved here, to have the courage to change something in your life, to apply for a new position, to apply for something different, you know, to move. You know, if you want uh, some kind of a change here, to not expect uh, uh, something different if you're doing the same, you know, same thing over and over. You know, it's just that building strength and tapping to that power to accept changes, to, you know, stand up for yourself as well. And it is yes for you guys, group group one, no doubt, manifestations, resolutions in the next few weeks. Yeah, that's what I have here for you, group one. I hope this helps you out to resonate in some way. If it does, let me know, leave me a comment. You know, I'm always happy to hear from you. If you want an extension of this reading or any other questions, my link is below for private readings as well for my Etsy shop. Everything you see in front of you and much more is there. If you're new here, consider subscribing, like and share this video. It helps the channel very much. And as always, I wish you a lovely, blessed and healing day. Thanks for watching. Group 2, if you chose Simplicity, we leave it here and we start with the pendulum straight away. So group 2, yes or no. Put some intentions there, guys, positive or negative questions. And remember, all my links are below if you want to have a private reading with me or anything from my Etsy shop. Group 2, yes or no. Try again. <laughs> okay. Let's try again. Group 2, yes or no. Positive or negative questions? We do have yes. Okay. Straightforward yes here. Hopefully you can see. Group 2 with simplicity. Okay. Let's see here. What else can we understand? We do have a yes for positive or negative questions. Anything else you need to do? Time will tell. There's a need to allow some time here, guys. Okay. So maybe you need to wait a little bit for this to manifest or resolve. Time, okay yeah three to four months in this situation okay so there's a time frame here for a reason it is yes for you you can already stay in that positive gratitude mind frame but there's something that you need to just wait a little bit simplicity you know sometimes we just need to trust and release to the universe and um, time will tell you know things will be unfolding for you learn from the past what else do we have here we have self-imposed limitations happiness and contentment and we have not the right time okay guys so it could be some of you really wanted to resolve this straight away you want the things unfolding right now and you're seeing here three to four months no i don't want to wait this long it's just to, to give a little bit of time you know time will tell you that it's going to be much better than you expect i feel like this is definitely a yes for you guys okay but you need to wait it's like not the right time right now it's not the right time I feel like for uh, some of you who are asking negative questions, time will tell you that, you know, things will be unfolding for you. You know, you have yes here, yes for negative questions too. But it's just not the right time maybe to approach someone to, you know, try to resolve this straight away. There's a need to wait here, you know. So it's going to be manifested, yes, but it's just a little bit of a wait. Three to four months is not, not that long anyway, but it is depending if you're thinking like, oh no, I really wanted this right now. It's just a need of wait here. Work on your patience, okay? There's some lessons here as well. We have learned from the past. So there's a reason for this wait too, guys, because there's a lesson. Maybe, um, you know, there's some someone else involved in your question that needs to still learn their lesson. Maybe you needed to learn a lesson here. So focus on that because self-imposed limitations is when we think something is more difficult than they are. And you chose simplicity. This is actual, actually simple. You know, it's simple enough to be resolved when we trust, when we just know and stay in that gratitude mind frame is going to be resolved, it's going to be unfolding for you, even if it's not right now, straight away, not the right time, happiness and contentment is coming away, you know, blessings, happiness, that contentment of the heart that you know you are on the right direction, also that contentment that it was worth the wait, you know, it was a good thing to be waiting, to not be stressing out about resolving straight away, you know, time will tell you that it's going to be you know, blessings coming away. There's a lesson here from the past, guys. So focus on that, you know, if there's something that you need to release, to resolve here from the past, to forgive, to heal. Because, you know, self-imposed limitations here, sometimes we limit ourselves when we get stuck in the past. When we think, you know, why did this happen to me? Instead of focusing, what can you do in the present moment that will help you to manifest, you know, have your resolutions in the future? Just keep that in mind, because when 
you know, discard cards learned from the past. It's because there's, there's still some lesson there for you that can be helpful, that can be beneficial for you. And self-imposed limitations when you think something is so difficult, when it's not, you know, it's just a matter of trusting on the simplicity of the universe, which is just releasing most of the time, you know, and not focusing so much. When is this happening? How is this happening? I don't know all the answers. And that's okay to not know all the answers. You know, because we need to trust as well the process, the transformation, the evolution of things, and enjoying day to day, you know, and uh, enjoying the process as well that you take one step at a time, because there's always lessons there. But I really feel here, guys, happiness is coming away, okay? We have yes for your question, but it's just a little bit of a wait, okay? And for negative questions, it is a yes, but I do see, you know, happiness and contentment coming away no matter what. It's just, uh, you know, some limitations here that you need to tap into, learn the lesson, and things will unfold for you quite simply, you know, and it's going to be much better than you realize. Yeah, that's what I have here for you, group two. I hope this helps you out and resonates in some way. If it does, let me know, leave me a comment. You know, I'm always happy to hear from you. If you want an extension of this reading or any other questions, my link is below for private readings as well for my Etsy shop. Everything you see in front of you and much more is there. If you're new here, consider subscribing. Like and share this video, it helps the channel very much. And as always, I wish you a lovely, blessed and healing day. Thanks for watching. Hi, group three. If you chose change, we leave here and we start with the pendulum straight away. So group three, yes or no. I remember guys to put some intentions here, whether this is a positive or negative question. And uh, remember my links are below if you want to have a private reading with me or anything from my Etsy. Group three, yes or no. Try again. Okay, so let's try again. Yes or no, group three. It is a yes for you, okay? Group three, we tried again, and it is a yes. So let's see what else you need to do here. Because there's some change as well. We chose change. So we do have gratitude, mind frame, honesty, and communication. Gratitude, mind frame. I say about that all the time. Recovery road ahead. Okay, guys, there's some recovery road here too. Give time to time. Also, light at the end of the tunnel. Is strength with love okay guys so straight away here gratitude mind frame i talk about that all the time because many times we you know keep waiting for something to happen to be grateful and many times you know it's just the other way around we just need to remember we always have reasons to be grateful and then more blessings come our way you know multiply the blessings that you already have so stay in a gratitude mind frame here we already have yes even if you don't know all the answers Honesty and communication here. So I really feel there's something that you can do here. Communicating, first of all, honesty with yourself, whoever's involved in your question. There's some kind of communication coming or that you needed to reach out here to someone. There's some kind of recovery road ahead, okay? So it feels like uh, this may be manifesting and you need to wait a little bit because there's some kind of recovery happening. You know, give time to time here. It's going to happen. You already have yes, but you may need to stay on a gratitude mind frame until you see this light at the end of the tunnel because you may not see the resolutions or things unfolding to you straight away. But there's a strength here, guys, that you can build with love, with loving yourself, whoever's involved in your question, or what you wanted to do to resolve or manifest this. This is yes, even for negative questions. You know, so there's a light at the end of the tunnel here anyway. I feel like there's some kind of a weight here for you guys to manifest this, okay? And there's some kind of a change here as well. You, you chose change for a reason. So remember here, it could be this recovery road. And it's a change for the best because, you know, there's something that you could be leaving behind. You could be traveling as well. It could be changing jobs, changing relationships, you know, changing cities. So it feels like uh, there's some kind of a change here that you need to embrace. And you stay on the gratitude mind frame until everything is unfolding. You know, so I feel like there's a few things going on and there's a recovery road anyway. So you are, you are recovering here. So this is a good thing. Blessings are coming away, but it's just for you to understand, you know, give time to time here because there's a need to just allow things to unfold naturally. You know, there is a light at the end of the tunnel already. So that's why you can stay in the gratitude mind frame. But there's some strength that's building, you know, strength within to change a situation 
to change jobs, to change relationships, to change the attitude towards a situation or towards yourself, to be honest with yourself, whoever's involved in this question, you know, so I feel like there could be a couple of things for you to do, but you already have yes for these four manifestations, yes for negative questions too, but there's something that there's a light at the end of the tunnel, should you be approaching someone here with honesty, you know, so I do feel like it's just a matter of a little bit of weight here, guys, but your blessing is coming, your manifestation, your resolution is coming here. It comes with changes. So don't be afraid of changes, of moves, of trying to do something different to get different results. Because what's the point of getting stuck in the same cycles, repeating the same thing over and over, expecting and hoping for something to change? You know, for some different results need changes. You know, so just to have the courage to do that as well. Right at the end of the tunnel, guys, even if it's a tunnel, it feels like it's a tunnel right now, it's a recovery road, you know? So just give time to time. You're building this strength just to stay in a gratitude mind frame. Yeah, that's what I have here for your group three. I hope this helps you out to resonate in some way. If it does, let me know. Leave me a comment. If you like these quick answers as well, let me know so I continue to add them. If you want an extension of this reading or any other questions, my link is below for private readings as well for my Etsy shop. Everything you see in front of you and much more is there. If you're new here, consider subscribing, like and share this video, it helps the channel very much. And as always, I wish you a lovely, blessed and healing day. Thanks for watching. Hi, group four. If you chose focus, we leave here for now and we start with your pendulum. So group four, yes or no. And remember guys, all my links are below. If you want to have a private reading with me or anything from my Etsy shop. Group four, put some intentions, positive or negative questions. Yes or no. Group four, yes or no. We do have yes. It is a yes. Group four, hopefully you can see here. I know, it's just moved here a little bit. But let's get more details, more information here. What else do you need it to do? I chose focus here for a reason. Pause and recharge. Interesting here with pause and recharge and focus. Flexibility and compromise. Focus, look at this, double confirmation. Focus and courage. Yes, love that. Your intuition is right. Yes, okay, double confirmation on the yes. Wow, guys, double confirmation here for you guys. And lucky change, yes. Finally here, guys, you know, lucky changes turning, coming your way, okay? You could have been waiting for this for a while. You could be thinking, you know, where is my luck gonna turn you know so when is this happening this is yes guys for positive or negative questions anyway but there's something that is going to unfold here some lucky change okay even for negative questions there's a need to focus you can see here double confirmation of focus double confirmation of yes this is definitely a time here guys for you to focus on that it's going to happen you know even if you don't know how even if you still need to resolve few things communicate here Pause and recharge. I feel like some of you have been working really hard trying to resolve this, trying to manifest this. And that's a good thing. You will see the results. But there's a need to have flexibility and compromise as well. You know, listen to someone else's opinion, advice, flexibility with yourself. Don't work too much, too hard, you know, because there's a need to pause and recharge as well. It could be that some of you are working very hard to manifest something. And there's a need to have time for you as well to pause, to recharge, to just, uh, you know, um, recharge and continue the next day or the next week but there's need to have a pause here as well you will see the results okay but there's need to compromise a little bit it could be on a time frame it could be on someone who's involved in your question focus okay guys we have double confirmation on focus so it could be the focus here what is distracting you in this case you know can you pause a little bit and just analyze what's not serving in this situation have the courage to cut away what's not serving and pay attention to your intuition your intuition is right okay so some of you could be already feeling what you needed to do in this situation some of you know that uh, uh, there is a situation that you needed to cut so the doors can open here so cut the cords with what's not serving anymore is it a person a place an attitude negativity you know something that you know is not good anymore for you you know it could be the job that you're not enjoying anymore you want to change you want to apply for something else doesn't mean you need to leave it at once but you start looking into something else even where you are, but a different position or different places or something that's resonating more with your intuition. Do you want to start, start your own business or in your relationship, you know, with this person? You know, what else can you do here to be very honest with this person? Or take a little bit of a breather, time for you. Why do you want to manifest some changes in your life? Changes of places, of houses, 
manifestations, blessings here are coming your way. There's a lucky change here, guys. And it could be that some of you are thinking, you know, I have been waiting for a long time. I don't see this happening. You know, your luck is going to change here, guys. Even if you felt like nothing was resolving, nothing was, you know, manifesting for you. There is a lucky change finally. And you can see here the double confirmation. So no yes for you. Also the focus. And I feel like the focus is very important. Focusing on your intuition. That is right. If there is something that you need to do. Having the courage to cut away. Also the flexibility. You know to change a little bit here. Is someone else involved in your question? What's the flexibility? The compromise that you need here. You know so just think about that. Take what's resonating for your situation of course. There's some kind of focus. Cutting away distractions. You know, cutting away what's not serving and your lucky change is coming. Yes, you can already stay, guys, in you know, that positivity, trusting your intuition, because this is definitely turning around here. Blessings are coming your way, no doubt. Yeah, that's what I have here for your group four. I hope this helps you out and resonates in some way. If it does, let me know, leave me a comment. Let me know if you enjoyed those short videos so I can add more to the channel. If you want an extension of this reading or any other questions, my link is below for private readings as well for my Etsy shop. Everything you see in front of you and much more is there. If you're new here, consider subscribing, like and share this video. It helps the channel very much. And as always, I wish you a lovely, blessed and healing day. Thanks for watching.